guys, welcome back. Part 2 of the Zavi birthday blowout that I went on. Uh, I got two. Buy one, get one free. Mystery box variants. They had variant 1 and variant 2. And in order to not get the same stuff, I actually got both of them. They were buy one, get one free. So I only paid £20 for both of them. And I'm going to start off with... Mystery box variant one men's double XL. Let's crack it open. It looks like someone may have already been in this because they've put two stickers on it. But let's have a look. Taking all, took all the good stuff out. Oh, this is the first shot I've ever got from this franchise. <laughs> I'm so glad this is my side. It's Hellboy. We have Hellboy. Kind of looks like me on a bad day. If you've ever seen me at work. If any of the, the viewers that have ever seen me at work. Sometimes I have a face like that. Same horns too. <laughs> and the second item out of the box. There's five items in this box in all. Is. Oh that's cute. We have a Winnie the Pooh daub. And uh, he's had a little accident with his honeypot. When doesn't he have an accident with a honeypot, to be fair? There you go, guys. That is actually really cute. I'm not a really big fan of dogs, but I, I like this one. And the second item is... Matrix Puzzle. And... There you go. That's what it looked like with the puzzle pieces, and that's what it's supposed to look like if it was a poster. This one is 17 plus. I don't understand why a puzzle would be 17 plus, it's only 300 pieces. But, there you go. I'm guessing they're going by the age on what you have to be to watch the film. Uh, third item, we're going back to the Doctor Who stuff again. No. Um. Slurring Warrior from Cold Blood. I think that's how you pronounce it. There you go. I'm not really into Doctor Who. Now, after the David Tennant one, uh, yeah, it just sort of. Yeah. Uh, and the fifth item. It's actually quite good value for money so far. £20. Buy one, get one free. So it was like £10 a box. Don't forget. We have a Mini Masters figure from Little Damn Heroes. We have Simon Tam from Firefly. There you go. I'm going to crack this open because it's really light. And just wondering if it's in there because that is super light. If I throw it up in the air, it'll probably float. Um, let's get in there and have a look, shall we? Oh, yeah, he's in there. The, pa the box and the packaging actually feel lighter than the uh, figure does on its own, which is strange. There you go, guys. Simon Tap. Yeah, uh, that was really strange. That the figure. You feel the figure? I'll have the missus confirm this. Yeah, it's really right. light. You feel the figure, and then I'll pop it back in the packaging. Yeah, not much heavier. It feels lighter than it than the figure on its own, didn't it? so weird. <laughs> Alright, so there we go guys. We got these five things out of the first box. There we go, we got the Simon Tan, the Doctor Who, I ain't even going to try the same name again because I think I butchered it. The Matrix Jigsaw Puzzle, the Winnie the Pooh Door, which I think is awesome. It's so cute. And the t-shirt. I paid £10 for the box. 
They were twenty pound each. I paid ten pound because they were buy one and got one free, which is awesome. Always looking for a bargain. And I'll give this one to the director, and the flat won't go in the hole. <laughs> As you can tell, we're very mature on this channel. And the second box, which is significantly heavier, it is variant two. Once again, men's double XL. I got in early. I was looking around on the website for a while. And we have in box number two, we have two dogs. One of which. I'm going to have stolen off of me as soon as I take it out of the box. Anyway, some more air. That one's not very cool. I've got cheated out of some air. I have a t-shirt from... What's it from? Nintendo Entertainment System. Zapper. I remember that. I don't remember that. Don't you remember playing it with Duck Hunt? I had the bazooka, but I didn't have the zapper. Oh, I had the zapper. I had the really big bazooka thing. If anyone remembers that coming out on the SNES. So, you can have this shirt if you want it. There'll be an image for the bazooka thing coming up right here. And there, are, there is five items in this as well. Oh, there's five... One, two, three, four, five. There's six items. And I now know why it was so heavy. We have a... That's actually quite cool. Not a big fan of Rick and Morty, but we do have an official collectible coin of Pickle Rick. Can you see that? Not really. No. Here we go, yeah. We'll have the missus throw up a picture if we can't get it to focus on it properly. Yeah, there you go. And on the back of it you actually have... Is it Rick? Yes, Doctor's Rick, right? We have Rick looking at the coins. And there we go. From Adult Swim. Don't really follow Rick and Morty, it's not my cup of tea. But, yeah. And we also have... Oh, it's a glow in the dark daub. W exclusive? What is that W? I don't know what that Walmart. is. Walmart. Walmart exclusive. Really? They really should change the local one as to them. Uh, we have a glow in the dark Batman door. I think. There we go. Let's see if it glues in the dark. Alright. We'll try it later later in the night. Let put it into in some sunlight, see what happens. And we also have Friday the thirteenth daub. We have Jason. I will let my missus pronounce this one. For his, because I never get names right. He looks really cute. He looks so happy. Maybe he just killed someone. Yeah, it does look like he's laughing his head off. To be honest, <laughs> right. Items four and five? Is it four and five? No, five and six. We have ooh, we have Star Trek graphic graphic graphic? What's traffic? Graphic novel from the Eagle Moss collection. Volume three. Hive. There we go. And it looks like they were making Picard into a cyborg on the back. is weird and the second one it's amazing I've never got a double one these we also have volume 4 Star Trek what volume is that that's just the next generation we have a volume 4 Spock Reflections Star Trek graphic novel there you go guys And that concludes this one 
I'll show you the combination of both boxes. I paid £20 for both of the boxes, which I think altogether amazing value for money. I got three daubs. Where's the other one? There it is, Winnie the Pooh. Still think that's really cute. Possibly the best thing out of it. <coughs> we got the Matrix puzzle. We got little the little damn heroes, Simon Tam. Never watched Firefly, we really should. We got the Hellboy t shirt. Don't forget about the Hellboy t shirt. We got the Pickle Rick coin. Got the Doctor Who figure. We got three graphic novels. One's missing. One's gone for a walk somewhere. And we have the other Super Nintendo. The Nintendo Zapper shirt. And where's the. Is in the box? We have lost one of the other comics already. Did it go back in there? Oh no, because it wasn't in. It was in the box. It wasn't in. Uh, no, that's why we couldn't find it. It was in the Z box. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven items for twenty pounds. And I know these comics on their own now about. Ten ninety nine retail. So for both boxes, it's there in the comic, the graphic novels already. The other stuff just puts it over the top, really. Uh, gonna have to decide what we're gonna keep, what we're not gonna keep. But as always, when it pops up on eBay, it pop up on eBay. Hopefully we'll be doing that either later today or Thursday. We wasn't able to do an update on eBay last week because we were working. We just finished doing 11 days straight. So hopefully this week we get to catch up on all the stuff that we missed. Thank you very much guys. And it's now on to part three. And I hope to see you there. Bye.